What's up guys welcome to the video tutorial for the learning light on C++ programming. This tutorial is gonna be the continuation on the previous tutorial that we have made on the static keyword and also you know using that in the classes. So in the last tutorial we have learned you know how to declare and use the static members in a class. In this tutorial we're gonna be learning you know how to create the static member functions. So a static member function is nothing but a function or a method in a class with the static keyword. So we're gonna see you know what is this static member function and also how to use that in our program. So here to our previous class definition that we have in this class human you know we're gonna be adding one static method to add a static method first we need to specify the keyword static and then the return type so it's gonna be void and the name of that method so it's gonna be human count and you know this method is not gonna take any parameters okay now in C++ to create or declare a static method you know we need to use the keyword static the first thing is you know when we create a static method you know that method is gonna have the class scope in other words you know this method will be shared by all the objects you know no matter how many objects we create of this class human you know there will be more than one human count static method and the next thing is when we have a static method in our class we can only use the static members of that class in this static method so we can't use any other variables you know other than static so here we can use this human count you know it is a variable human underscore count and uh, the static method name is human count so don't get confused with it all right we can access this member inside this static method just to demonstrate that i'm going to copy this c out from the human total method and i'm going to paste it here and the next thing is to call this method or to call a static method from a class we're going to use the scope resolution operator so to do that i'm going to remove this anil dot human total method here and uh, i'm going to write human and then scope resolution operator and then the method name which is human count and that's it now i'm gonna save this i'm gonna build and run this now you guys can see there are four peoples are there in this pro program so a static member function is nothing but a method or a function in a class with a keyword static and when we use static methods in a class you know we can only use the static members or the static variables of that class in that method and uh, to call that method we can use the scope resolution operator along with the class name and no matter how many objects we create of that class which contains a static method you know only one copy of that method will exist so thank you for watching and i'll see you in the next tutorial